Hey, good morning everyone. Chris here. Kind of a cloudy, crappy day, so I decided I'd do a video on my internet connections and stuff up here. And the purpose of this video is to show you that uh, some of the old school techniques are still pretty good. Uh, as you may know, I installed a dual band TP-Link gigabyte wireless router, uh, AC 1900 I think it is. And I was getting, you know, really good speed with that. But recently what I did was uh, installed a gigabyte switch and we'll walk up there and I'll show you the gigabyte switch. And I ran a Cat6 Ethernet cable through the attic into the living room. And I'll show you that here in a second too. But let's go up here and I'll show you what I did. And as you know, I don't have cable TV anymore. That's actually just an antenna. I just got an attic antenna. And that dropped my bill. <laughs> Shoot, probably almost 100 bucks a month. But this is the um, TP-Link Gigabyte switch, network switch. I forget the model number on it. I'll put it in the links below. But anyway, I've got this connected to one port here on the AC1900. It comes over here, and then I distribute um, all the stuff in here. And actually, I ended up, I only have one port left. And it works beautifully. Beautifully, beautifully, beautifully. All right, let's go inside. All right, here's where the Cat6 cable comes into the living room. That outlet there used to be for cable TV. What I did is I used a hole saw and cut a hole and took out the little female to female connector in there and just ran the Cat6 cable here, old school, and into the laptop's Ethernet port. Okay. Now, let's look on here. I'm not going to do a screenshot thing. I'm going to try to put this camera right on here. This is uh, my Ethernet status on the Network and Sharing Center uh, control panel. And as you can see, the speed is 1.0. Hoorah! So she's cooking along real good. Let's do a speed test. I'm paying for, I think, a 55, download 50, upload 5, with my internet package, which is 69 bucks a month through a local cable company. So I got 59.59 megabits per second, pinged at 18 microseconds, it's not bad. Not good, but not bad either. Okay, so I'm paying for um, 50 and 5, and I'm getting, I'm exceeding that by a lot. And that's just with running old school Cat 6 cable on my, right into my uh, direct instead of using Wi Fi. Now I do have a Wi-Fi uh, dual band extender and I have a uh, something called a bridge for the smart TV and an adapter, a USB adapter, a 3.0, USB 3.0 adapter that goes into the TV. So my internet TV is actually direct connected to the Wi-Fi extender which is connected to my network, home network. So. There you have it. Just thought I'd show you this, guys, on a cloudy day. And thanks for watching. See ya.